안녕하세요. 저는 로키입니다. Welcome to today's video, Luckies, where we are going to be reacting to a video which has recently been put out by one of my reactor peers, and that is Save One Drop One 2021, January to June. And this one has been created by GZB Karma. So definitely go and check out her channel. I've been watching her reactions uh, even before I actually became a YouTuber and a reactor myself. So of course, uh, you know, massive shout out to the OGs. But she also puts out some absolutely awesome content like this as well. I've seen um, a, a few few videos quite similar to this um, put out I think by her as well uh, over the last year or so. Uh, I think there was one probably about six months ago but there definitely have been this trend there, there has like been this trend with these types of videos uh, circulating around for quite some time so uh, I'm really excited obviously to play this because I've never personally played this before on a reaction uh, with you guys so I'm really really pumped to do that but I'm also excited to see and hear your opinions on uh, which ones you would drop and which ones you would save and also see whether or not we have uh, similarities in terms of uh, our choices. Now, of course, no hate and nothing but love for every single one of these groups and of course every single one of these songs because I'm just going to assume uh, that they're titles and honestly, like almost every single title that has come out this year has been an absolute fucking slapper. They go absolutely so goddamn hard, but there definitely are bound to be, um, you know, ones that will stand out to each person dependent on their personal taste as well. So I'm really excited to see if given the option uh, which one I will actually take but I'm just hoping that there's no extremely difficult matchups because then I'll be in for a world of pain <laughs> you know with alt groups I find it very hard to separate my bias and for me to um, really kind of like be objective I will try as hard as I possibly can and I will try and like just go from the standpoint of like what do I listen to right now the most and I'll try and think about things that way but yeah I'll, I'll pause uh, I don't really know how many of these title tracks are included here um, but I will pause um, each time I think that I need to talk through it if I've got any crazy thoughts or if I need to kind of work through things but uh, yeah just bear with me this will be an interesting video it'll be re really fun obviously to film I'm sure and uh, I can't wait to get into it with you so without any further ado let's get straight into it y'all let's go ahead and give it a massive old like let's go full screen and let's start our reaction in three two one let's go Espa first straight away I'm here for it Okay, you can choose to play the game and actually save a song and drop the other or just enjoy the songs that came out this year so far. Enjoy. Not all of them though. Okay, I reckon I'll, I'll, I'll only pause it if I have thoughts or if I'm confused or not sure and need uh, time to work it out. Because yeah, it's a 30 minute video. There's a lot of songs that have been released uh, in the last six months. So I'm sure that there'll be quite a fair bit. Also, is it only title tracks or B-sides too? Chicka -da, chicka -da, chicka -da. Huh. Already? So back, yeah. Oh, first ever glow. Ooh, that's tough. Straight off the bat, huh? Straight off the bat, huh? Ooh, that's tough. Odd Eye versus First. You know, I've been listening to a lot of First lately. I've been listening to a lot of first, but I feel like, I feel like Odd Eye has a crazy amount of staying power with me, you know, like Odd Eye is easily, um, within one of my top songs that have been released so far this year. And I mean, I recently did go through this with my bias list video and, you know, first wasn't far off, but I'm, I'm, I, I think I still listen to Odd Eye a lot more. I think for me, it's the guitar in Odd Eye that really gets me. Just the riff is so good. I, I, I don't think that I can like really stray away from that. Who knows what Because is going to be like, because that's actually going to drop tonight. That's going to be freaking amazing. So Insomnia, I hope you guys are ready. And I mean, we'll be all dead by the time Insomnia's even watched this video. So good luck. I hope that you guys enjoy the funeral because I'm going to be dead right next to you. But um, yeah, I think, I think I would say Odd Eye for me. I love Everglow and I love their most recent comeback. It's probably my favorite one that they've come back with so far. And the energy is wild, but it'll, it'll be Odd Eye for me. Ooh, AB6. What are we going against? Our oh, one is. Mm, this is, see, this is interesting because one is, I feel like I would always pick. 
Hmm. Okay, I will pick one S. One S I would normally always pick, but you see the thing is, AB6, that, that song Close is also really good, and I've listened to that quite a lot as well. But yeah, I would say I would say one S. I would say one S. Yeah. Oh, WJSN. Can I breathe? Nah, nah, nah. Or GWSN? WJSN. Easy. I love GWSN though, but. Ooh. Two PM. Oh, newest. Uh, I'll say two PM. Two PM. Jesse. Ah, and Sunmi. Ooh, that's tough. I really love both of them. I really love both of them. If it was Nunu Nanna, if it was Nunu Nanna by Jesse, I would choose Jesse, but I'll choose Sammy. Also, Sammy coming back next month, gonna be freaking hype. It's gonna be freaking awesome. I can't wait. But, dude, Tail is something else. I love that song. BDC, I don't know them. Sounds fire, though. I'll say AB6. Oh, and hyphen. Da, da, da. Ooh, that's hard. In hyphen or shiny, huh? Let me go back. Let me, let, yeah, let me go back. You know, you know, you know. Ah, oh, this is tough. You see, this is tough, but I feel like purely just out of the two songs, the one that has stayed on my playlist longer is in Hypen. It's in Hypen. But the group that I know more and that I love more and just because I know them more and, 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 and really vibe their music is shiny. So for the group, it's shiny. For the song, it would be Drunk Dazed. Because that song is fire, though. I can't deny it of that. That song is freaking fire. Don't Call Me is as well. But it's just one of those songs where, like, I listened to it a lot to begin with. But it has actually, it has fallen off my playlist a little bit. If anything, I think Body Rhythm has really, really, really taken over for me. Uh, for shiny for that don't call me album i think if it was going against that it would be a different story but yeah i would say drunk dazed yeah in hype who are versus light sun bro i'm sorry but i'm sorry yeah follow the lights huh. dude we did i mean I'm sorry, man. We did song out dirty there. Come on, we need to let her finish the verse. <laughs> Follow the lights. Ha. Huh. Okay, look. Ua, I like. Ua, I like. I'm getting into them a lot more as well now. Ua, I like. Purple, I like. But light some. What can I say? Like, light some, light some are my girls, bro. They're my girls. They, like, so far, so far, light some have been one of the most pleasant experiences of 2021 for me. I love them. I absolutely love them. But the song too, the song is amazing. It's a fucking bop. I love it so goddamn much. So it's lights up for me. Yeah. Follow the lights. Huh. Ooh, Daniel. Uh, 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 uh. I swear to God, I'm not going to pause the whole time. Uh, damn it. Um, 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 I'm going to say antidote. All right. Woods. Woods. Oh, you gum? You gum. Uh huh. Try B. Hey. Oh, hot issue? 
Oh, wait, 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 wait. I haven't heard Hot Issue though. I need to go back. Okay. Off the preview, I would say try me. But Hot Issue sounds sick. What the hell? Gravity? Hey, hey. Who are we going against? Oh, Victon. Okay. Yep, Victon. Victon. Oh. My girls, Chebu. I already see it. It's ASAP. Yep, ASAP. Stacy. Don't copy. Well, you know. <laughs> well, Stacy. Let me say something about Stacy real quick. Stacy. This, even since my bias list video, even since my bias list video that I did probably, what, two weeks ago, Stacey have climbed even further. This song has climbed even further. Does it keep rising? Yes. Is it, is it like, literally taking over my life? Yes, though. Because any time I hear it, I can't stop jamming. Like, you know, ASAP, I loved when I first heard it. I loved it even more the second time I heard it when I first reacted to it. But then every single time that I've listened to it since then, it's just like, I don't know, man. They're perfect. Stacy are going to be huge. They're going to be massive. Cherry Bullet, I absolutely freaking love them. And I, I, I absolutely adore them. But if it was like, if it was hands up, it was going against, I wouldn't know. I think I would be a little bit more confused. But Cherry Bullet, I listen to this song a lot. It's still comes onto my playlist and I bang it, but I will always seek out Stacey's ASAP once a day. I seek it out literally at least once a day. It's amazing. Oh, they're amazing. Ooh, hello future. Ooh, wavy? No, treasure. NCT. Hey. Joy, are you? Are you? <laughs> Easy, without a doubt. Goodbye. Hey, amazing. Ah, B A one seven three. Yeah, yeah. What a pop. B A E. Hey, majors. Ooh, rocket punch. Easy. This song will not get out of my head. Oh, house party. This is my house party. SM battle, huh? Oh, SM battle, huh? Oh, okay. I need to go back. All right, man. I need to... I need to I need to seriously think about this. You know I'm going to say Super Junior. I'm going to say Super Junior and I'm going to say Super Junior because you know I don't know too much about them but I freaking love this song. I love it. it stays on my playlist. It keeps getting played. Don't fight the feeling. I do really love as well. There's um, a very sentimental and very special reason why I love it too, and that's obviously because Lay is here. And of course, we get some dope. We get some dope parts of this. Like we also get um, the 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 XOSC rap break. It sounds absolutely freaking amazing. They look amazing too. But I would definitely have to say Suju here. Suju, Suju. I, I love this song so goddamn much. And the switch up in my house is just too fucking good. It's way too good. It's way too good. Pink Fantasy. Oh. Uh huh. Pixie. Ooh. Now, I've not listened to Pixie yet. Have I been meaning to get into Pixie for a very, very long time? Yes, indeed, I have. But. Am I gonna choose Pink Fantasy here beyond the fact that I've just only recently started listening to them a hell of a long, like like a, a very short time ago and not for a hell of a long while? Yes, but also Poison is a crazy song. It's a freaking crazy song. Both of these look like really dark concepts though, but Pink Fantasy, I need to get into them. I need to get into them. This song is wild. Wild. 
Pixie seemed crazy though. Ooh, only one of. Maybe that was crazy. Ah, only one of. Yeah, I choose. I choose Libido. Hmm. Yeah, but dum dum dum. Yeah, I, I choose Tribe. Tribe. Oh, this is hard. Oh, that's fucking hard, man. Oh, jeez, that's tough. That way, that's tough. That's tough. Hot sauce, hot sauce, and fireworks. I'm the one. Have been probably two of my favorite BG releases this year. Oh, that's tough. Ooh, that's tough. Damn. Because what do I love about Hot Sauce? I love the pre-chorus in Hot Sauce, especially Hechan's pre-chorus. I think it goes hard. The rap, a little different. It's 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 probably not the hardest part about the song for me, like the rap breaks. The chanting though on the chorus though, hot sauce, keep it dip that. I love that. The energy of hot sauce, I really vibe. Eighties is fireworks though. Yeah, look, you know, you know, I, I'll say I'll say eighties. The only reason I will say 80s though is because one, the Mingi rap in it is just cooked. It's crazy. It's cooked. It's fucking insane. But also on top of that, it's like the beat. You know, I, I love that beat. Ever since we heard it um, at the very end of Inception, I was like hanging on that beat. Um, I, I, I adored it. I, I really enjoy the song. I, yeah, I just couldn't think of which one I played more and, and you know, what, what, like, what I've listened to a lot more, but I would definitely have to say it would probably be fireworks. Yeah, I'll go with that. I'm content with that. Trippin'. Ghost Nine, right? Mm. I'll probably say Trippin'. Oh, Gambler. Hey. Oh, this is wavy. Kick back. Oh. 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 Paint the town. Okay. As much as I love Itzy, it's Luna. It's Luna for me. Yep. Great songs though. Ah, uh, the eight. Oh, double B. Bam Bam. Yeah, I'll say Bam Bam. Oh, Mama Moo. Oi, why are we doing this? <laughs> oh my god, the RBW battle? Shit. Uh... Mm... I will say Mamamoo. Yeah, I'll say Mamamoo. Yeah, I'm confident with that. Oh, Epex. Pay, pay, pay. Oh. Oh me This is really this is really hard. Oh lockdown versus Komnani. Okay, this is a case. I'm trying to not think about the group and trying to just think about the song. If this was going up against, so if if lockdown was going up against Siren, it would be Siren every day of the week. I love Siren. It's still my favorite song from them. It's still my favorite title from them. Komnani, I like. So scared, I really like, but it hasn't stayed on my playlist that much it had it hasn't it hasn't stayed there it, it was probably it was i probably listened to it solid for about maybe one or two months uh and then it just 
kind of got a little bit lost. I, I I didn't listen to it as much recently. I mean, if it comes on, I will still vibe to it. But Epex, I have really, really been vibing lately. I've, I have I still need to listen to the album. I still need to listen uh, to their album as well. But that, that track, like just... Lockdown sounds absolutely freaking wild, so I, I I love that. I'll go Epex, which is weird. Chunga vs Chunga? Oh, bro. I mean, it's Chunga. It's dripping lower. When the thing's done, it's freaking over. And flying? Ooh. 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 And flying moonshot or one we aurora. Moonshot. Moonshot. I love Aurora though. Oh, the boys. Oh, it's too young. Ugh. I'll say the boys. I need to get into gravity. Omega X. I haven't checked them out yet. Based on the preview, Omega X. Oh no, look, look. This is not fair. Oi, this is not fair. This is actually not, this one's not fair. Espen next level. Versus weekly after school. This is... Yeah, look. This one's not fair. I actually forgot about this. <sighs> Last night. Last night. While I was on Discord... I was talking one of my great great friends Kaya the Safe Cave uh, over here on YouTube. She she actually reacted to this video, which which prompted me alongside the notification to also do the same. And uh, I thought that this would be really fun. And I remember some of you guys brought up in Discord that Esper were up against uh, 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 up against Weekly, and um, I I was like, oh, okay, cool, 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 cool. I I I heard that there was this. I forgot about it until now. Hmm. The problem with both of these groups and both of these songs, the problem with both of these groups is that both of them are like teetering on my alt status, like teetering, and they're rookies. Ah, uh, which one? Which one? Which one? Which one? I love Espa. I love Weekly. I absolutely freaking adore Espa. I think they're amazing. They're super crackheads. They're such they're such incredible girls and they make incredible music and they're so talented. But I just feel like after school has me in like the jaws of life. You know, it's like it's just it's got me in the jaws of life and it will not let go. One, the chorus is just too goddamn hard. But two, the uh, that bridge, the bridge is gorgeous. I, yeah, I, oh, Espa, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry. It's after school. Oh, I, I'll try not to pause anymore. My right, Ghost Nine. Oh, DKB. Yeah, DKB. DKB. Pian. Hey, hey. Yeah, Pian. I go Pian. I love Son though. Oh, Astro. One. One. Victon. Victon, as much as I love Astro, that song. Ugh. Yeah. Bobby. Bobby. Majors? They sound great! Bling bling? Not heard of them? I'll go Majors. Lucy? 
Hey, hey. Are we up against one Wii again? Veronica. I'll choose one Wii. One Wii. Hey. Ace? Said I wouldn't pause again. I'm sorry I lied. Damn. Damn, 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 damn. You know, okay. Alright. Alright. Okay. 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 I can say this with confidence. I can say this with confidence. I can say it. Alright. Burn it. Golden child, I would save. Ace here, I would drop. Why? Well, I don't know. I really don't know. Burn It is quite literally one of the only Golden Child songs that I've ever heard. I still need to get into them a hell of a lot more, but there's something about this song where I can't stop playing it. It's still on my playlist right now. It's still on my playlist. I was inspired even watching Road to Kingdom to go and listen to more of their music, and I still want to. And I just reminded myself with this video that I still want to. But comparing it to Higher, I enjoy Higher. I like it. But even then, for comebacks, recent comebacks as well, it's it's probably not at the very top of my list in terms of comebacks that I'm constantly listening to right now. So I would have to say I would have to say Burn It by Golden Child because the MV that also goes with that is gorgeous. But uh, the song, I love. I absolutely love that song. It's freaking amazing. And it's like, what, already seven months old? It's like six, seven months old. It's crazy. Well, T01. Right, I'm going to try not to pause now. Let's go back. Let's go back. Based off the preview, mid air. Ooh, Bray Wells, Shima Baram. A. Ah. Uh, twice. I would choose twice. A lot of people didn't like alcohol free, but I love that. Ooh, pumpy. Beckyun. Oh, let's go. Dun, dun, dance, dun, dun, dance. This is really hard. Oh shit. Um damn it. Damn it. You know, okay. I adore you from us nine. I adore you. I adore you. I adore you, but I love Dun Dun Dance. It's my it's my summer bop of the year. I just need to go back and listen to it again. It's my summer bop of the year. There's no changing. Yep. It's it's my summer bop. Yeah, yeah. Oh. What you what you want? Oh, wow. oh Nagya. Jesus. Ooh, butter. Is that TXT? TXT. What is TXT? Mm -hmm. Ooh, Rose. Who we got next to her? Oh. Wendy. This song is amazing. The whole album. Oh, I know I love you. Is that Stray Kids? Oh, eh? Easy. Oi. Easy picks, easy picks, air. Every day of the week. Okay, this is hard. This is really hard now. Purple Kiss or Idol? Idol. Ooh. No diggity. It's that bitch. A wee eye, I liked. No diggity though. No diggity every day of the week. Oh, wind blows. 
Grand Budapest. Dreamcatcher. Once again, do I need to react to Pixie? Yes. Oh, ready to love? Ready to love. This is difficult. Let's go back. Pentagon. Pentagon. Ooh, third eye. Hey, hey. Mages. I need to listen to them. I'll go third eye. Ooh, Hoshi. Such a great song. Hoshi. I'll still go with Hoshi. T1419. MCND. I'll go MCND every day of the week. And yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, Rose again? Oh, come on. You can't put Rose against IU. 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 Celebrity. Ooh. Ace. 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 This song is amazing. I love Down, bro. Bye bye bye. bye. Oh, CIX Cinema. Cinema. Cinema, cinema, cinema. 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 Ooh. Wait, is that Tribe? I just recently listened to Loka. Hmm. Skip Skip is a freaking bop though. I'll go Purple Kiss. Skip Skip. Trabi da Loka. Although Trabi go high. Very, very first. I'd still say very, very. Oh, oh, are we? Oh, my, my, my. Uh, Paranoia. Paranoia. I love Tamien's advice though. Ooh, Demente. WJSN The Black Easy is one of the best songs that I've heard from a subunit in a billion years. It's literally one of the best songs that I've heard from a subunit in a billion years. I love this song so much. Chunga is quite literally one of my alt soloists. She is so high on my bias list as far as soloists are concerned as well, along with IU and Taeyeon. But uh, dude, yeah, look, WJSN The Black takes this out. Mm. Wow. Day six, oh, one week. It'll be one week. This song, amazing. Ah, yeah. Is this even a question? Is this even a question? Just then. You know, with alt groups. I find it very hard to separate my bias and for me to um, really kind of like be objective. I will try as hard as I possibly can and I will try and like just go from the standpoint of like what do I listen to right now the most? End of flashback. Who are we up against? Idol? Look. 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 I love Idol so, so, so goddamn much but as you can see, there is no way, there is, like, I'm sorry, there is no way ever 
There is no way ever that I could put an Eyes One song up against another song and not choose the Eyes One song. Why? Because honestly, for me personally, it is it's got nothing to do with other groups. I absolutely adore Eyes One's discography. It's just ridiculous. It's ridiculous. The fact that Dee Dee Dance is quite literally a promotional single though. The fact that it's a promotional single and they went that goddamn hard on it is just amazing. It's one of my favorites, if not my favorite promotional single that they've ever released. It's honestly one of my top tracks from them. I love it. Oh, 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 yeah, you do, Wimby. You know, she knows. <laughs> God. I love you, though, Idol. Oh, Chemion. Shua. Oh, on and off. Who we against? Now, bum 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 bum. On and off. Oh, Kingdom? Hey. Ooh. Spin off. Oh, easy. Attitude. I got no attitude. Yeah, eyes one and saw you. Easy. Zero attitude. Easy. Ooh, highlight. Not the end. Great song. Oh. Why, why, why? Icon. Ooh, Super M. Super M. NCT 127. I'd save. Save. Oh shit, man. This was tough. Yeah, right. So she did. She has done previous videos like this. Oh shit. Eyes 1 vs. Dreamcatcher. Holy fuck. What a video that would be. Oh my god, bro. I Have I seen that one? Have I seen that one though? Did I actually watch that? I can't remember. Oh my god. Dude, what a thumbnail that is. I'm triggered. <laughs> Dude, they're literally, they're literally my top two girl groups. Eyes One and Dreamcatcher, top two girl groups. I, I, oh, holy shit. I, yeah, I kind of already know what that answer would be though. If it was Panorama versus, versus Boca, it would be, it would be Panorama. Look, anyway, this, this was freaking awesome. I, I really enjoyed this and I do apologize for this reaction being an absolute fucking mess. Um, somehow it's been 39 minutes now. And so look, I'm just going to say, let me know down in the comments below whether or not we had any matches, what you guys thought of it. Um, and also whether or not we had any really big differences or if you thought I might go a different way. Um, I'd be really excited to hear what you guys thought as well, especially if you happen to be playing along too. So do let me know, y'all. But once again, if you enjoyed this video and you'd like to see more, make sure to give it a like. Subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss out on any more of my reactions just in general. And of course, until next time, take care of yourselves out there. Stay safe, but most of all and above all else, make sure that you guys are staying happy. And I'll see you in the next one. Cheers.